Welcome back, Downers. Today we're going to make some fried eggs. Let's get it. Welcome back, Downers. Um, today we have a quick little breakfast recipe uh, for you. Uh, we went ahead and uh, got our skillet and put in some olive oil, heated that up over medium high heat. And then we went ahead and cracked in some eggs. Uh, we put in three eggs and seasoned that up with some salt and pepper. Once the uh, eggs start to cook through and uh, solidify on the bottom half, we went ahead and tried to flip them over. Um, you can see this uh, egg here is not budging. Um, the, 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 this pan that we have, I think this is a T-Fowl pan. I think it's on its last leg and the, uh, the non-stick aspect of it isn't working so great. Uh, but once we were able to sort of flip that egg over, uh, the yolk busted out of that one, but it's perfectly fine. Uh, we can still work with that. Uh, we just went ahead and seasoned the other half of it with some salt and pepper. And then we, uh, put down some jalapeno i mean put down some uh pepperonis but pull those up put down some turkey slices on top of that and then put down the pepperonis on top of the turkey slices uh, because we're going to flip these over and i basically want the fat from uh the pepperonis to help grease the bottom of this pan basically let some of that uh flavor from the pepperonis come out of it but it's also going to help to everything release once we uh finish cooking it um, went ahead and put down some jalapenos and then topped them off with some Munster cheese slices. Uh, only put some some of our homies on one of them. Um, the wife doesn't like pepperonis on everything, so I'm <laughs> helping her out a bit and just putting on one. Um, I can add it to my plate later if necessary, but just wanted to put down on one to help that cook in with the eggs. Um, just let the heat from the uh, eggs go ahead and melt the cheese. And um, once everything is heated up and cooked through, we're good to go. This is how our uh, turkey, egg, and cheese, fried fried turkey, egg, and cheese looked once we plated it up. Just basically just put them down onto a plate. Uh, you can see on some of them the cheese didn't fully melt, but as it as the heat you know, continues to go through on the cheese, it will continue to melt. And and if, if, if that bothers you or anything, but it doesn't bother me at all, I'm still going to knock this down. Um, but this came out very nice. Um, you can add whatever meats or veggies that you want to this. Um, I'm basically just going through the refrigerator and, and just clearing out some stuff that we had that I felt would go well with this and that we had available. Uh, but you can use whatever you want. You know, you can use um, different lunch meat, some ham. You can use some uh, leftover hamburger meat or chicken breast. Um, or you can just do all veggies and tomatoes, bell peppers, onions, uh, whatever you want. I'm just using cheese on top to help melt it through. Uh, here we are doing a quick little taste test, just cutting it open. Um, tried to go use everything and use a uh, fork um, to, to go ahead and pick this up, but it wasn't budging with the fork. So I just went ahead and used my hands and just folded this over like a little taco. Uh, uh, and that worked fine for me. <laughs> um, hope you guys like this recipe. If you have any questions or comments, please, please feel free to let us know in the comment section below. And as always, thank you guys for watching. Enjoy. Enjoy. And please subscribe. Enjoy. Hey, Towners. Please like, share, and subscribe. If you have any questions or comments, please feel free to leave them in the comment section. All ingredients and directions are listed in the description box below each video. And as always, thank you guys for watching.